The nose knows. See? Reward. Meet Nemo, a two and a half year old, 30 kilo German Shepherd. At this customs and border protection training facility, agents and dogs work together, the canines leading with their noses, which are many times more sensitive than ours. And sniffing out fentanyl, the most dangerous illegal drug in America, is nothing especially difficult for them, according to Nemo's partner, Jessica Perone. Good job, bud. It's just the same as any other trained odor for the dog. Um, each trained odor, they go through, you know, a particular process, and uh, it's really just the same. It's just another game for the dog. Adrian Guerrero, who oversees the training here, says what the canines can do on the job never ceases to amaze him. Placed in the correct position and environment, the dog's capabilities are limitless. But what if there was a technology that could accurately and constantly detect the thousands of kilograms of fentanyl coming from China and Mexico? The White House Office of National Drug Control Policy decided to hold a contest with a half a million dollar grand prize to find that out. The winner was Integrated Defense and Security Solutions near Boston. Its 3D X-ray computed tomography scanner called the Detect 1000 is already used for detecting explosives, says CEO Jeffrey Hamill. We have artificial intelligence algorithms that does this in airports, and we can train those algorithms on fentanyl and other narcotics, the same way we train the algorithms for explosives. The Detect 1000 can work around the clock, doesn't need bathroom or meal breaks or sleep. If somebody gets creative on a concealment, on how they hide the drugs inside the package, um, they can be fooled. Or the dog might be having a bad day, just like a, an airport agent might have a bad day. So with a machine, and a machine trained on looking okay. at specific Brandon. properties so of the narcotics or drugs, it'll give you the same answer every time. The dogs of CBP will not be out of jobs anytime soon, even if technology for detecting fentanyl is widely deployed. They will still be working to sniff out other illicit drugs and the people smuggling those narcotics. Steve Herman, VOA News, Front Royal, Virginia.